welcome to See the Ramadan Stories. This is our signature segment of the three-hour news show, right? right? And as we all know, we are now in the middle of the holy month of Ramadan, when where Muslims are fasting. Fasting, yeah. And often, while we wait for iftar, we look for activities mm -hmm. that can make the time go faster, right? right? What do you usually do? Well, crazy, I tend to go uh, with my mom and my family to go like shopping mm -hmm. or do something you know what i mean like to grab some food for breaking yep. the fast yes. or sometimes we do some art art mm -hmm. and speaking of art today um we're going to be talking about painting so painting is one of our recommendations and bartega studio which will be our source of the day yep. offers a painting class here in jakarta yeah, Bartega is a Jakarta-based event management company that was founded in April 2017, which specializes in hosting acrylic painting workshop. Bartega Studio dedicates itself to create fun, stress-relieving social activities while helping people unleash their inner artist. With a mission to inspire creativity, Bartega encourages its participants to enjoy the process of creating artwork that ultimately leads to a mindful living habit. Bartega's founders made the Forbes 30 under 30 Indonesia under the business and entrepreneurs hip category back in 2020. And guess what? We now have here in the studio the people behind Bartega Studio that offers painting classes in Jakarta. So let's just greet them. Hi, Nadia and Jazz. Hi, welcome Hi. to Hello. our studio. Jazz how and Nadia, how are you? I'm good, I'm good. We're great. So, very happy uh, to be here. Yes, very glad to have you in the studio <laughs> with us today. So let me just explain to you the whole situation here. Mm -hmm. We have a different set. It is because uh, Nadia and I will be painting, right? Yes. What are we going to paint today, Nadia? So we have these um, ceramic bisque. Yep. So these are not fired yet. We mm -hmm. are going to be painting them with these little glaze yep. paints over here. Meanwhile, Adith and Jazz, what are you guys going to be doing? Yeah, Jazz and I will talk about Bartega in background and what does Bartega Studio hold a special event in Ramadan. So Jess, uh, could yes. you tell us, um, actually in the Ramadan, like the previous um, stories, Bartega holds some classes in painting, right? Yes. So in, in the holy month of Ramadan, so do you um, like make the special class in the Ramadan? We'll yes, so we actually way. created a Ngabubrit yeah. event. Right. So Ngabubrit event? Yes, so right. like that's uh, the classes that we offer at our booth in Ashta. Right. So we have a lot of different activities. We have mm -hmm. canvas right. painting where people can paint together with their group of friends. Right. We also have a Moroccan jar painting where they get to paint with gold paints. And we also have our pottery paints that people are doing to paint with their loved ones. So well. the media is not only in jar, but also in, how do you say that? Um, That's the canvas. canvas. Yes. And do you have any like media, like maybe shoes or we had We don't have shoes as of yet. But, but you, you, you do that? Yes, we do that. We do right. that as well for our corporate events. But right. we also have painted in t-shirts mm -hmm. and tote bags. Mm -hmm. We do a lot of materials that we can paint acrylics in. Like Recently, we patterns, actually just painted in done. a bag. Like oh, a bag? A bag, yes. Uh, a bag circles. that people can use on it. All right, Jess, so talking about Ramadan yeah, event, you yes. told me before that um, you got a special <laughs> class in <laughs> Ramadan for people you know, to waiting for breaking the fast time. Yes. Iftar. Yes. So uh, how many people actually uh, go to your class? So in a day we have around ten to fifteen. Ten to fifteen. Uh, yes. It's uh, a huge number. Do. Yeah, mm -hmm. because the activities that we offer is quite unique as well. Right. So people can actually paint whatever they want. Mm -hmm. So it's not just a theme that we decided, but let's say if you and I we want to paint, let's say a bird, for example. Right. They can just come there and use our supplies, and they can just channel their inner creativity and just paint whatever they want. <laughs> so like, uh, people might just come to your class and explore themselves. Yes. and just be creative as uh, yes. as we are mm -hmm. and just like uh, put 
all the ideas on the media, right? Yes, because sometimes we ho we offer in-person teaching as well. So our right. instructor will be guiding the participants to paint the subject that we decided on. However, a lot of the participants usually just freestyle it. They can paint whatever they like and we just help them with our supplies. It's quite interesting. Yeah. So I just really want to know, like, I'm not um, that artistic. I mean, mm -hmm. like, I do paint, yes. but just like random painting, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. uh, just scratch on the paper with pencil and some stuff. Mm -hmm. So um, do you require some level to join to our class or you just like welcome every like levels of people? We welcome painting? everyone to join. So right. our class are beginner friendly. Right. And we have classes for adults mm -hmm. and kids. And what's unique about Bartega events is that our class is catered for those who don't have any experience in art at all. Yeah. We will provide a step-by-step -step guidance. So including me. <laughs> including you as well, yes. So we'll help you uh, understand the medium at hand, the acrylic medium, how to use the different colors, how sure. to create the background, the materials on the canvas. Mm -hmm. So we will guarantee that you will uh, go home with a painting that you will be proud of. Oh, right. Mm. So uh, basically, uh, psychologically, people might say that to do painting, like you paint something, you can really stress. Yep. So uh, Jess, could you tell us what exactly the benefits of painting? So painting is actually a great way for us to really stress. Right. Uh, once you get rid of the worry about making a great painting and you just focus on the uh, process of creating, mm -hmm. You can actually, in a way, um, meditate as well through the process of art itself. Because uh, by painting, you can actually release endorphins. Uh, that is uh, the, the hormones that actually make you feel happy to release um, endorphins and reduce stress. Mm -hmm. So, yeah. so um, releasing stress is the most important thing. I know living in Jakarta, like so stressful with traffic jam and exactly, everything. Exactly, painting yes. is. Uh, might be your options to release and you can come to Bartega studio, right? Yep. So uh, Could you tell us uh, what age actually we have to learn to do painting? I mean like in, in the short of my age Not that young anymore. Yes. <laughs> Did you think that this is the right time for me just to learn uh, from the beginning or what? I personally think there is no age for when we should start or when we cannot learn painting again. Right. Because you can always pick up a paintbrush, you can learn how to create an artwork, how to play with colors. Right. Because art itself is not something that you should be intimidated of. Because sometimes people in Jakarta or Indonesia, they are afraid to create an artwork because they feel like, I cannot make a good painting, that's why I'm not going to start mm -hmm. paint, I'm a painting. But once you get rid of that mindset and you can just try to paint whatever you like, whatever you feel like painting, that's when you actually will feel the benefit of what painting can do for you. Right. Because so, painting is a, I feel like it's a great way for us to channel our inner self, inner creativity. It's a great way for us to self-express as well. Because sometimes by creating an artwork, you can tell things that you cannot communicate um, and that by itself is a form of healing as well. So is it true or not, a good painter need a talent? Uh, no. No? No. So we don't need to uh, require some talent but to do painting? Even right? if you have a talent but you don't have the motivation or the grit to like follow through with what you right. want, the talent will go to waste. That is exactly. We yes. need to motivate ourselves. So. Over there, there's a two like motivated two and artists. talented artists. <laughs> yes. Rizia and Nadia. Yes. Oh, so far you're painting. I mean, can you show the camera? What are those? <laughs> I'm making flowers. <laughs> got, right? I'm making flowers, right. but I'm not done yet. So I'm making the petals and the middle part of it. Mm -hmm. And then I'm going to draw the leaves, which uh, I'll be using this uh, blue color over here. Nice. Very nice. Okay. Thank you. Yo, no problem. Thank you. <laughs> so until we're waiting, Krizia and Nadia, and we have also Jazz, we will continue our talk. And Nadia and Krizia will continue their painting, but we have to take a break, stay here and see the Ramadan stories only in three-hour news show.